Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to tell you something about a temperature sensor, which is very well common in the marine field and which is widely used. The name is PT-100. So, let's start and uh, we'll see how to calibrate or how to check these sensors uh, using a temperature calibrator. So guys, uh, on my right, uh, you can see this is a PT-100 temperature sensor. This is basically uh, based on the resistance measuring principle. So the material used in this sensor is platinum. That's why it is called platinum temperature sensor or PT-100. So 100 uh, indicates that at 0 degree Celsius, uh, it will give 100 ohms of reading. This sensor works on um, resistance measuring principle. With every single increase in degree Celsius, like if there is an increase of 1 degree Celsius, uh, close to 0 0.39 ohms will be increased. So, approx, if you calculate, uh, it is like 0 degree Celsius will be 100 ohms and 100 degree Celsius, it will be like 140 ohms. This PT-100 is used, you can say, uh, you can find it everywhere on the ship, like main engine, generator, incinerator, wherever you want to uh, monitor the temperature, these are very commonly used and they are very precise also. So, they are widely used. So, you must know how to calibrate them. These PD sensors, they comes in 2 wire, 3 wire and 4 wire system for the accuracy. 4 wire is more accurate. It is like uh, very fine. Uh, and But in marine field, you will find 3 wire system which is very common. In, and for 2 wire, 3 wire and 4 wire, uh, you can see uh, how there is a wiring system and the color code can see in the right. These sensor comes in uh, different classes like class A, class B. Class A, uh, we have temperature range of minus 100 to plus 450 degrees Celsius and class B uh, is from minus 190 or 195 degrees Celsius to 600 degrees Celsius which is in the positive. So right now the sensor which I have is a class B, PT-100. So friend, uh, here you can see I am using a calibrator in that I have inserted uh, my PT-100 and I am having one fluke multimeter. It is showing a uh, triple one reading right now. Hence, I have a problem that I don't have a correct size of uh, probe connection for my thermometer in ca calibrator. So you can see uh, there is a gap uh, which is going to show you a lesser reading because heat transfer will be uh, delayed because of a proper attachment to the calibrator. So I'm going to switch on my calibrator and you can see right now 27.7 degrees Celsius. This is the room temperature you can see and it, it was showing triple one reading. So at 27.7 degrees Celsius, the ohm value is triple one. You can see in the multimeter. Uh, now I'll be changing the setting, set value of uh, calibrator to 30 degrees Celsius. So that uh, at various temperature range, I will show you the uh, ohms value. So I will set to 30 degrees Celsius and we'll see uh, how these readings are changing in your multimeter. So from 27.7, the calibrator is heating the thermometer and you can see from triple one, it is changed to triple 1.1. And it will slowly, slowly, slowly increase because every one degree increase uh, in one in every one degree Celsius increase, uh, it, there will be a change of 0.38 or 0.39 ohms. So next, I have changed to 40 degrees Celsius, and you can see from triple one it changed to triple 0.5, and it will keep on increasing. Uh, there will be a difference in my own, uh, you can see, sorry for it, um, because I don't have a probe connection for calibrator. So, you can see here, uh, this calibrator takes time to settle up because it will, hit, uh, it will hit the thermometer very fastly and then it takes near about 5 minutes to settle up and transfer the heat to the thermometer. Now, I have changed the setting to 60 degrees Celsius and slowly 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 our ohms value is also increasing 
So starting from triple one, now it is one one five point two. So next is hundred. So at hundred, it should be close to one thirty eight, one thirty nine. But uh, due to improper connection, I'll be having uh, close to one thirty, one thirty one reading. So you can see here from one eighteen, it is changing one nineteen. And once it set to hundred, it takes near about five minutes. So you can see this countdown: five, four, three, two, one. And you can see in the multimeter, we have reached up to one twenty nine point one. Guys, you can see uh, my calibrator is set to hundred degrees Celsius, but my multimeter is still showing one thirty close. It's just because of uh, heat transfer between calibrator and sensor. Sorry for it. So guys. I hope uh, you get to know something in this video. Uh, see you in the next video. Till then, bye bye. Take care.